today uh, we are going to discuss about the level of uh, human development in different countries we will also talk about the variations that exist and also the reasons for these variations in this topic it is not that those countries which are having which are bigger in size have a better human development index there are many smaller countries also which are having better human development index than some of the bigger countries we can take example of our country itself countries like sri lanka trinidad and tobago have a better human development index as compared to our country in our country itself we have similar type of variations like kerala is having a better level of human development as compared to the states like punjab and gujarat which are having lower per capita income as compared which are having better per capita income as compared to kerala so there are variations and uh, the size is not an important factor for uh, having a better human development index being economically rich is not a criteria for higher level of human development what level of freedom has been given what level of opportunities have been given to the people is the most important criteria for for having a better human development in any country or a region on the basis of the level of human development the countries can be classified into four categories this has been this categorization has been done on the basis of the human development index or the scores that different countries have been given by the UNDP the countries can be classified as countries with very high human development index value countries with high development index countries with medium index value and countries with low human development index value earlier the, the countries used to be categorized only into three groups and uh, the countries with very high human development index and high development index were clubbed together however we are having a system in which we categorize the countries today into four categories like that the basis for identifying the countries into different categories is the scores that they achieve in the human development index issued by the UNDP those countries which have a score above 0.8 808 are identified as having very high level of human development those having the score between 0.807 to 0.7 are identified as high level of human development in their country and those between 0.556 to 0.699 are identified as countries having medium level of human development and those which have an index below 0.555 are identified as having low level of human development different countries of the world have been put in different categories on this basis by the UNDP providing education and health care is an important government priority countries with higher human development are those where a lot of expenditure is made by the government in social sectors higher investment in people and good governance has made these countries apart from others 
and these have a higher better human development index many of the countries with high and very high level of human development scores are located in europe and are the highly industrialized countries of the western world countries with medium level of human development come make the largest group most of these are the countries which have became either independent after the second world war or have started building their economies after the destruction of the second world war many of these countries have been rapidly improving their human development scores by adopting various people oriented policies and reducing social discrimination most of these countries have a much higher social diversity than the countries with higher or very high human development scores but they are doing well in improving the conditions of the people and bringing improvement in the life of the human beings a large number of countries which are in the low level of human development list these are the countries which are going through political turmoil and there are social instability in the form of civil war famine or have a very high incidence of diseases so these countries which do not have proper economic development and proper infrastructural facilities to cater to the needs of the the people they are basically in the low level of human development index group now to understand if we want to understand why these why a country have a high or low level of human development it is important to look at the pattern of the government expenditure on the social sector the political environment of the country and the amount of freedom people have is also important countries of high level of human development invest a larger amount of their expenditure in social sectors and are generally free from political turmoil and instability distribution of country's resources is also done in an equitable manner on the other hand those countries which have low levels of human development tend to spend more on defense rather than bringing social welfare for the people that is in the social sectors this shows that these countries tend to be located in areas of political instability and have not been able to initiate accelerated economic development in their country